are jailed. Former Malaysian Prime Minister Najib Razak says he could serve the rest of his prison sentence under house arrest. He claims that former King Sultan Abdullah issued an addendum order that would allow him to do so. Melissa Goh has all the details from Kuala Lumpur. Now, former Prime Minister Najib Raza is seeking to be released from prison to serve out his jail sentence under house arrest. And that, he claimed, was the order from the former king, Sultan Abdullah of Pahang, who chaired the Pardons Board's meeting on January 29th one day before his tenure expired. Now, the Pardons Board later announced that Najib's sentence was halved to six years and his fine was slashed from 210 million ringgit to just 50 million ringgit. Now, Najib is to be released from prison in August 2028. But now, the ex-Prime Minister claimed that there's an addendum to the former king's order that wants him to serve out his remaining sentence under house arrest. Now, his lawyer has applied for judicial review on April 1st to confirm the existence of such a letter in a bid to compel the government to execute it immediately. You're very sure that the addendum is in the hands of the government? Uh, we are confident, yes. In the court application, Najib's lawyers said that they came to know about the addendum on February 12th and has written to the government to seek clarifications. But so far, no one has responded. They have named Home Minister... Attorney General, the Prison and Pardons Boards, as well as de facto Law Minister as respondents. As of now, I can say clearly that I have no knowledge about it. Under the federal constitution, the king can pardon, suspend and reduce sentences. His decision cannot be challenged in court. Now, the hearing for the judicial review application is fixed on April 17. Melissa Goh, CNA, Kuala Lumpur.